This document, entitled Human Fraternity for World Peace and Living Together, signed by Pope Francis and the Grand Imam of Al-Azhar, has already inspired concrete projects. For example, the Oasis of Mercy Orphanage in Cairo, Egypt's capital, is 50% complete and is projected to be open next Christmas. A copy of Michelangelo's Pietà will be added to create a Marian shrine there. The beauty of this story is that in this moment of difficulty and crisis, a moment where many only speak about the negative, some people have decided to speak about the positive, and not only to speak about the positive, but to create something positive. The orphanage will be able to house 300 Egyptian children, where they will also be able to receive professional training. Chef Francesco Mazzei, a knight of the Italian Republic and renowned chef, decided to join the project. With him we will turn the orphanage's kitchen into a cooking school to teach these children and young people how to cook and show them that they too can become chefs. The Bambino Gesù Association of Cairo project began as a result of a generous initiative by the United Arab Emirates and inspired by the document on human fraternity. Now, both Christian and Muslim donors have joined the association in creating new projects to serve others. The association hopes to lay the foundation for their next focus, the Bambino Gesù Hospital in Cairo, soon. The hospital in Cairo will be supported by the Bambino Gesù Hospital in Rome and will be built following the model of this hospital. Therefore, doctors from Egypt will come to Rome to receive training. Although the dream of the human fraternity document has already become a reality in Cairo, there is still a long way to go. But this association is a first step in creating a more unified world dedicating to serving others. Doctors, researchers, and historians help us decipher the most remembered crime in history. For the first time, we look at the mystery of the cross from a scientific perspective. The Passion of Jesus, a medical investigation.